All right, so welcome back to another video. This is Divine. Welcome to the first video that's ever being uploaded onto this channel, but not my other channels. Thank you guys for watching this uh, and picking this channel to um, watch. Uh, so we're going to be watching Crucifix. Um, there's a song called Heaven. It's um, It was recommended by somebody, and they were like, hey, you should uh, wa listen to these songs by Crucifix. And I got a few songs by them that I'm going to be watching. But today we're going to be listening to a song called Heaven. Let's get into this. If you guys really enjoy this episode, please subscribe, like, comment, and hit the notifications bell to be notified when I upload again. Okay. Eyes of a dying man It's like there's something there He can comprehend don't understand me So I really don't know if he's Christian or not I really don't even, I don't even know This is the first time I've ever heard of him Um, here's, a, here's the rosary He has a cross, as a belt I don't know I don't know, we'll see Call a fear Or a certainty For the watch There's always a link around Question about eternity Eternity can't help but think about where am I going when it's said and done. Only God knows it. No! Okay, so he's talking about life and death right now. Where is he going? Uh, he says, Where am I going? Um, when this life ends, only God knows. I don't believe that only God knows. I think you know. Let's be honest. If you've truly repented from your sins and you've truly given your life to Christ and you declared with your mouth that Jesus is Lord, then you're born again. It's good to get baptized, but I mean, you're baptized spiritually even by the Holy Spirit when you accept Christ as Lord and Savior. Baptism by water is a personal confession and an outward expression of your faith in person so people can see what you're doing. It actually makes people question what you're doing, and when you tell them, they're very interested in what you guys do. Um, I've had that actually happen. There was a there was a baptism I went to, and we're out by the beach, and we're, I was on the boardwalk taking faraway photos and everything, so we can get like because there was a lot of people, a big crowd, and I want to get some faraway shots to see how big the crowd was. And I was over by the big boardwalk, the uh, no, um, that was not, it wasn't the North Jetty, it was Sharky's Pier here in Venice, Florida. And I was standing by a couple taking photos of the baptism, and uh, the the husband stood and was just like, "What are they doing?" And I'm like, "They're getting baptized." Um, and he's like, what do you mean? And I said, well, we're, we're, we're Christians. And this is to show our outward, you know, this is how we show people that, you know, we're Christians is when we get baptized when the Holy Spirit washes away our sins. And he's like, hmm, that's interesting. You know? So it brings people into like a whole sense of mind like, oh, well, what are they doing? <laughs> what are they doing? It's interesting. But you should know. You should know. When you die... What, are you going to heaven or hell? And I have a sign that says that. When you die, when you where are you going? Heaven or hell? Heaven with God or hell separated from God? Because hell is all that God is, but opposite. So you know if you've truly given your life to Christ. Everything after life under the sun, sun, sun. And so I slip away, slip away my thoughts. Think about my right and my wrongs. And I realize this life is just a breath, breath, breath. This life is just a breath. So I think he's really just talking about how long life is. To God, it's a sliver. It's not even a sliver. If you got a line and drew it out all the way across the whole universe, life is the tip of a needle. It's very short. God is outside of time. He doesn't see time. And time doesn't affect him. So for him, life is just... Not even that. But he can go into time. And he can, he can experience and he can see what it's like. And that's what he did when he came in the form of Jesus. But what are we going to do with that sliver of life? What are we going to do with our life that we have? That's the question. Cause time is shorter than I know. Oh, oh. Somewhere deep inside, I just can't wait to go. To go, to go. 
Oh, I love that. You know, somewhere deep inside, I just can't wait to go. That's amazing right there. That's sometimes how I feel. You know, I, I sometimes like question like, God, when you, when you, when are you going to take me? <laughs> when, when are you going to take me? I want to go. Like, I just want to go. But then I realize, you know, I'm here for reasons to glorify God and to make disciples. So I like that. I like that. You know, I always wonder, <laughs> can I go yet? And lift this veil from my eyes and fly away. When I step my dirty feet into the pearly gates. Oh, jeez, this guy is good. Bro, I'm so happy you recommended me this. This guy's good. Wow. When I step my dirty feet into the pearly gates. It's like you're sin and everything. You just, you walk in and you just get judged by God. But what God sees is Christ because you've repented and given your life to Christ. Your sins are washed away and all he sees. But it's like, oh, that's amazing. I've never actually heard it that way. You know, getting your dirty feet and walking in. But, oh, jeez. And I finally see my best friend face to face. Down the street to go In a moment surrounded by Everyone I've ever known I love that I love that Walking down the street of gold And surrounded by the people that I've ever known That is amazing That is amazing This is what Christian music should be This is what it should be it, it, this here brings wonder to God It brings wonder to who he is as it, as a whole this is what christian music should be not the repeating phrases of lord i want to feel you lord i want to feel you lord i want to feel you x 60 times it shouldn't be that music should bring glory and wonder to god and this is what this is it brings wonder and it brings glory to god i love it i love it oh jeez can't help but notice there's a perfect smile on every face Shouts of joy, you call my name Overwhelmed by a peace that I can't describe That I can't describe And so I slip away, slip away my thoughts Think about the world that I lost And I realize the world that lays ahead No more crime, no more pain, no more suffering. Oh, jeez. Dude, you better not copyright me, man. I mean, I don't care if you copyright me. Just don't don't take away, you know, the ability for people to hear this and see this video on my channel. So, bro, you're... These lyrics are amazing. They are absolutely amazing. Bro, who... Dude, I'm so happy that... Someone recommended me the crucifix. I've never heard of this guy. something about this song that just really really is amazing um there's a lot of people that you know that you know when you do good things when you bring someone to christ you get awarded in heaven and that's something that a lot of people um you know they don't really know that how important it is to bring people to christ and to be ministering to people and make disciples but the more you do that the more the more awards that you get for me personally i don't really look up to the awards i don't I don't. And when we go into heaven and you pass the judgment that we're all going to face, it says everyone will face it. So that's the unbeliever. That is the believer. That is everybody. Even if you did not know about God, you will face a judgment. And that could be a whole other lesson I could do on my other channel if you guys want.
But for me personally, it's like we have a house being built and prepped for us when we get to heaven. A house is going to be ready for us. And depending on what we did on this earth, how many people we we brought to Christ will determine the how big the house is. But for me personally, I'm not looking for a house. I'm not looking to be rewarded. To me, I just want to be in heaven in the presence of God. That's my mindset, is that I just want to be with God. It, it could be, for me, as simple as having a hammock in between two palm trees, and that's it. That's it. I don't care. I'm in heaven in the presence of God. I have a hammock set up in between two trees. I am seeing my loved ones. I am seeing the people that I saw my... my my cousin that just recently passed away from cancer. I'm going to see my Aunt Laura that died from cancer years ago. With no disease in their body. Perfectly formed. And then after that, coming back onto this earth for a thousand years. To reign this earth with a glorified bodies with no disease, no pain, no suffering. With God. All because we gave our life to Christ and we submitted to his authority. This is, song is a beautiful it's beautiful oh, oh. I'm never, never and lift this veil from my eyes and fly away. fly away I've waited all of my life for this day when I step my dirty feet through the pearly gate I'm never, I'm never man, 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 that's beautiful. The stuff that he mentions, it, it's amazing, you know, lift the veil off my eye, my dirty feet, and the pearly gates. No sin, no pain, no, no suffering. This is what Christian music should be. This is what it should sound like. Crucifix, you're amazing. The lyrics are beautiful. Oh, jeez. I'm so happy I got recommended this guy. Jeez. Thank you guys for watching. Comment down below what other songs you would like me to listen to. And trust me, I have a list. It's a big list. But I really am going to react to all these. And I will. They will be uploaded very soon. So thank you guys for watching. Hit the like button. Subscribe for more. Tell a friend. Tell a friend. Tell a friend. Let's get this. Let's blow up in these people's faces. I'm kidding. I'm not here for like subscriptions. I'm here to preach the gospel. I love this. Thank you guys. This is amazing.